Hello, dear viewers, and welcome to a new episode of Games and Names. Our sport for this episode is the Indonesian-based uh, indigenous martial arts sport of Silat, and our star guest is uh, Ibrahim Mitwelli. He is the coach of Egypt's national team for Silat. He is one of the founders of the Egyptian uh, uh, Federation for Silat, and he's also the first Egyptian uh, to become a guru or a, a master in the sport of Silat. So let's get to know more about Silat and about our star guest, uh, Ibrahim Metwelli, in the upcoming minutes of Games and Names. Silat is the collective term for a class of indigenous martial arts from Nusantara and surrounding geocultural areas of Southeast Asia. It is traditionally practiced in Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore, Brunei, Southern Thailand, Southern Philippines, and Southern Vietnam. There are hundreds of different styles and schools which tend to focus either on strikes, joint manipulation, weaponry, or some combination thereof. The word Silat is used by Malay speaker countries throughout Southeast Asia, but in further extent, the Silat martial art is officially called as Penchak Silat in Indonesia. The term Silat has been adopted globally in reference to professional competitive Silat for sports, similar to Chinese word Wushu. Regional dialect names including Pencha in Sudanese, uh, Silak in Megangabao, Main Po or Main Po in the lower speech of Sudanese, Gayong or Gayung in parts of Sumatra, Indonesia and Malaysia, and Dika or Parik in parts of Thailand. Penchak Silat is one of the sports included in the Southeast Asian Games, the S. EA Games and another region wide competitions. Penchak Silat first made its debut in 1987 uh, in the Southeast Asian Games and in the 2018 Asian Games, both of which were held in Indonesia, the home of the sport. Training halls are overseen by separate national organizations in each of the main countries the artists practiced. These organizations are the Penchak Silat Association of Indonesia and uh, also the uh, Perakutuan Silat Kibangazan Malaysia and uh, the Silat Brunei uh, Darusaim in Brunei and uh, Perasakutuan Silat Singapura in Singapore. Practitioners are called Pesilat. Silat Malayo is one of the Silat styles. The term Silat Malayo was originally and still is used in reference to the Silat systems in Riau archipelago and neighboring regions. Silat Malayo is often associated with fixed hand positions, low stances and slow dance-like movements. While these generalizations do not necessarily reflect the reality of Silat techniques, it has a notable influence on the stereotypical way the art is portrayed in Brunei, uh, Malaysia, Singapore, and of course in Indonesia. Again, the base of the sport. Both Benchak Silat and Silat Malayo were recognized as a piece of intangible cultural heritage by UNESCO. The United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization in December of 2019. My name is Ibrahim Mohammed Mitwelli. They call me Ibrahim Mitwelli. That's my nickname. I've earned my Bachelor in Sharia and Law from Al Azhar University. I'm considered one of the first Egyptian students to have enjoyed Silat training in the country. My serial number is number one as far as registered Silat players in Egypt are concerned. I was lucky enough to have been the first in the country to earn the Black Belt and the Black Belts group. I'm the first player and first coach to have earned that honor. 
إدارة المدرسة يعني ونشر السيلات في مصر بإذن الله. فن البنجاك سيلات عموما مش زي أي فن إحنا شفناه أنا اتولدت في I'm also honored to have been uh, one of the pioneers uh, in establishing Silat schools and academies in Egypt and to have had a role in spreading Silat across the country. The art of Silat is really special. I come from a sports family since my brothers were sports coaches in different games. As for my attraction to Silat, it came after watching Guru Absil Abdurrahman while studying at university in the year 2012. As I was really impressed by the art and its every aspect, and I went to Guru Absil Abdurrahman and asked him to train with him. And since that day, Silat has become an integral part of my life. Silat gives you nobleness, psychologically and morally, aside from the beauty and elegance of its moves. And it really suits us as Egyptians, as we are generally fond of noble characteristics and morale. ويعني يتميز بالأخلاق العالية من من هنا يعني بيميز إن هو يعني من الأفضل بالنسبة لنفسي يعني وأرشحه ل برشحه دائما لأي صديق إن هو بي بيكون الأفضل بالنسبة للمصريين لأنهم بيحبوا ال الحاجة اللي فيها الأخلاق يعني بي بي بيتميز بذلك. فن البنجكسيلات عموما بي بي بيتميز بان هو مختلف في اخذ النقاط عن الفنون القتاليه الثانيه الفردي وهو التونجل في سيلات سكورينج سيستم از ديفرنت فروم اذر سيلف ديفنس اند مارشال ارتس games as we have individual competition the tungal the doubles which is the ganda and the collective competition which is the rebo points are awarded for style as well as for combat our sport is distinct as far as judges empires and referees are concerned as they outnumber almost any other sport they are scattered around the different sites and corners of the court and the aim of course is precision and fairness as far as judging is concerned here in egypt we were successful in bringing up groups of umpires where I have the privilege to lead one of them. We have male and female umpires for the sports in the country. This was done under the auspices of the Indonesian Cultural Council here in Cairo and the Egyptian Federation of Silat. Our sport is also distinct as it follows uh, and allows punches by hand, feet, and really all parts of the body. 
بفضل الله كنت انا منهم من الشباب ومن البنات تحت رعايه المركز تحت رعايه المركز الثقافي الاندونيسي هنا في القاهره بالنسبه للبطولات اللي انا اشتركت فيها اشتركت في مؤخرا اشتركت كلاعب مع جرو عمر عبد As for recent championships I've taken part in I went to the World Cup as a player with Guru Omar Abdurrahman where we performed a duo very successfully while as a coach uh, uh, I uh, along with my assistants we prepared a group of students that are now ready to go to the World Championships like most prominently female star Fatima Musaid مؤخرا اتدخلت عن طريق مدرستنا الطالبه فاطمه مساعد واخرجنا جيل كامل من المساعدين المدربين من الاناث ومن الشباب عشان يتاهلوا ان ينتشروا في في على مستوى الجمهوريه بالنسبه للمشاركتي انا كلاعب من 2012 من 2012 تمت مشاركتي كمدير I founded my academy in the year 2012 and started it in Tafahna Al Ashraf in rural Egypt we then moved on to Az Azi before moving to the capital Cairo then I coached at the Indonesian Cultural Council 
in the capital and from there we were able to spread uh, the sport across many governorates in Egypt uh, like Kafr al-Sheikh, uh, al-Bihira and others and we were also able to attract hundreds of players from all across the country. Here in Cairo, we were also able to coach in several youth centers, including in uh, Nasr City, uh, Al Maadi, and others. Our Talago Bureau School is considered the official school for Pinchak Silat here in Egypt, and this, of course, came after the authorization of the Indonesian Cultural Council here in Cairo. أو تنتشر لكل المحافظات من من منذ بدايتها يعني بفضل الله تم تم تأسيس لقواعد المدرسة ووضع الأسس والقواعد والقوانين ومتطلبات المدرسة عموما ثم بعد ذلك جلنا الطلبة عن طريق الكلية ومررنا من جميع المحافظات من كفر الشيخ ومن الشرقية ومن البحيرة وشمل محافظات كتير بفضل الله ثم بعد ذلك انتقلنا here in Cairo, we were also able to coach in several youth centers, including in uh, Nasr City, uh, Al Maadi, and others. Our Talago Bureau School is considered the official school for Pinchak Silat here in Egypt, and this, of course, came after the authorization of the Indonesian Cultural Council here in Cairo. و... ومن ساعتها وتم تأسيس لمدرسة تلاجو بيرو ك... كأن هي تكون توكيل مصر للبنجاكسيلات في مصر في اتحاد في في دولة اليمن في اتحاد في دولة الجزائر في اتحاد في دولة فلسطين في اتحاد في دول مثل There are Silat federations in many Arab countries like Saudi Arabia, Algeria, Yemen, Palestine and others. We founded the Egyptian Federation of Silat in the year 2014. It took only a couple of years for our national team to take part in the Pinchak Silat World Cup in the Indonesian capital Jakarta in the year 2016. Then in 2018 and in another World Cup, our national team was able to impressively grab the bronze medal in a real quick achievement. One thing I'm really proud of is that we trained everybody who came to us seeking Silat knowledge 
We did not desert a single student. وتم حصد الميدالية البرونزية ورفع العالم المصري في على المنصة التتويج بفضل الله ومنافسة الدول الكبار في في فن البنجكسيلات سريعا يعني وصفات لعب السيلات بالنسبة بالنسبة لي من وجهة نظري هو إن هو يكون متحلي بالأخلاق إحنا منساعد أولا على الأخلاق. First important characteristic a Silat player must have is the possession of deep morale. As our sport, like many others, looks up to freeing one's spirit and enhancing ties between mankind, raising the banner of love and tolerance. We want and we build a confident, fast, strong, but lovable and non-violent athlete. في المجتمع عضو عنيف لأن الرياضة عموما بتشكل كيان للشخص مهذب في المجتمع لعب السيلات عموما مجرد ما هو بي يعني اولا لابد وان يحرص على <تصفيق> الاتيان مبكرا علشان ان هو يكون سابق المدرب من احترام المدرب Naturally punctuality is key for success as a player's arrival before the coach shows respect and discipline A sila player is also supposed to clean the court as a show of respect for the place and for his peers. 
As in any other sport, we start our training sessions by fitness, which includes running and stretching. In Silat, the one key aspect before playing is a concentrated breathing exercise, as correct breathing uh, techniques uh, helps you get rid of poisons that may be stored in your body and, of course, uh, helps in freeing up your spirit. Then, with an ascending order, as far as the degree of difficulty is concerned, we start practicing our moves from the easiest to the most difficult, as I said. We practice the group of moves that is called Jurus in the Indonesian language. Of course, we group the players according to their rank, starting from the beginner's white belt, to the yellow belt, to the red belt, to one strip red, to two strip red, until he becomes an, or, he, or she becomes an assistant coach then a coach and getting the honors to be able to spread the knowledge of Silat, which is truly a pure science on its own. يعني ملم بكل الحركات وكل الفنون القتالية المطلوبة على أساس إن هو يكون شخص ينفع غيره ويفيد الآخرين من علمه يعني لأنه هو علم كامل بمعنى الكلمة.